everybody, meteorologist Michelle Muscatello here. Amazing difference getting back to nor normal highs will do after the record cold we had earlier this week. Lower 50s through the afternoon and uh, then dropping as we head towards the evening back into the 40s. Any Friday night lights may be attending. You're going to want a warm coat and probably hat and gloves by the end of it as the temperatures cool from the 40s back into the 30s. But the real shot of cold air comes late at night after midnight as a strong front comes through. It's going to shift the winds to the north and west and drag down some colder air. So when you wake up Saturday morning, not only is it much cooler, but it's also brisk and that brisk cool air will last through the daytime on Saturday. Let's get a closer look here at what you wake up to Saturday morning. We are back to sunshine by Saturday morning. 7 a.m. temperatures in the lower 20s and we'll climb only back into the 30s during the afternoon hours. As far as what it will feel like, got to factor in the winds gusting in the morning hours at least to 30 miles per hour. Not quite as strong in the afternoon, but you can see those wind chills going to be a factor for your Saturday. Sunday starts off very cold and then Sunday afternoon not quite as cool into the lower to mid 40s with increasing clouds. I'm tracking some rainfall, but not until Sunday night. It's a ocean storm that's going to be off the Carolina coastline for most of the weekend, then lifting north and affecting us Sunday night and through Monday. That's a chilly rain on Monday morning during the commute and possibly a little icing over the Worcester Hills and points to the north and west. For 5 o'clock Monday evening, still potentially some chilly rain falling. So we'll keep you updated on that. The detailed forecast always on our website on the detailed weather page, WPRI.com.